Hello you guys, welcome to my channel. It is a cold, cold day. It is 12.55 p.m. and I'm trying to feed me a lunch. Right here I have some mixed fruits for her. I have banana orange medley and I put some um, some of this powder blend, probiotic iron, mm, whole grain and plant protein um, rice cereal in it for her and so she is a really good eater but so far she doesn't really seem interested and that might be because i gave her a bottle earlier i'm going out in a couple of days and so i received this package mm. oh that's cute I also bought it a couple of days ago. What's this again? I don't even know maybe a lingerie. Oh girl, it is. Mm. <laughs> oh, I'm comical, honestly. I bought these two um bras. Oh, the backs are really, oh my God, they look small. I mean, my boobies are, oh, they're small. They feel like they're not even at the right place. As in the boobs are not even. What the hell? I'm, I'm literally gonna have to try these on. What about the straps? We can't wait for a return, not Nino. Y'all, hold on. I'm about to try it on right here because I literally feel like I'm either coming on here naked or in a swimsuit. This is what this looks like. And now, is it pushing up and doing what I want it to do? Yes, but it does feel a little bit small. I can't lie. I mean, I guess it's okay. It gets the job done. I have this tube top dress that I want to wear. This has got to be my grocery delivery. Hello? Hello? Groceries? Delivery? Delivery, I'm here. Okay, I'm coming down. I'm coming down. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, you know, it looks... It looks fine. It gets the job done. Um, it's a little tight. Maybe the more I wear it, it will um, loosen up. <laughs> Damn, we're doing it will loosen up. But um, it's on the last setting as well, so I don't really know. I think I should have gotten a size bigger. But I can always save this for daughter beans. So I'm going to go downstairs and get the stuff, and we're going to come back. I think the delivery guy should come right to the door. I think. We'll see. Put y'all back here so they don't see. Okay. okay. So, so, we got three cases of water delivered because water is a staple. It's a 24 cases, but honestly, it's whatever. This container has a few left, so I'll just put them on the bottom of her high chair. Oh, I did, I redid her hair and it's so cute. breaking her neck to look at them you know baby it's one thing about my kids they are always going to look presentable and like little girls meaning their hair is going to be done so i have 10 left in here but um like i was saying to you guys i um i'm gonna either make the bras work or you know they're small enough to fit Dejeuner. She's going by Deja these days. God, teenagers. Oh, this is cute too. Pink, lace, yeah. What else do we have? And we have these two um, shapewears that I need to try on. I bought two, one is small and one an extra small, but I wanted something that goes up, you know, to the under boob area because my stomach is the one area of my body that I'm the most insecure about. I bought extra small and I bought a small. So I'm gonna try it on in a small first and see. And if I feel like I could take a little, maybe I'll try the extra small on first. And if the extra small is too tight, then I will try the small. These were bought from Shein. And this obviously extends over your shoulder. So really works out here, really works out. 
But that's all I bought this week. I'm trying to not spend because I literally don't have to. I don't go out often enough. But this is a special occasion. And I am going out. And I want to just look and feel my best. You know, I'm working out. I'm working on my body. But in the meantime, I... I'm going to do what I have to do to still look snatched and feel good about myself. Though, no, not as snatched as I want to be just yet. So, I'm going to try and feed Mia. I'm going to try the shapewear on. not going to try it on on camera. Because I'm... You know what I mean? Like, I can't. Never cold. Um, and I'm going to text my friend. We slept a little bit early. Oh, also I'm going to pack out the groceries. But let me show you guys. Maybe I can do that and show you guys. This delivery has mostly stuff for Mia. So like her little fruit packets and you know that stuff. I also bought some fruits. I bought some paper napkins. Definitely need these always. I really just went to get like her little fruit pouches, her little cereal, stuff like that. But while I was there, I'm like... Okay, there are a few items that if I buy them on Walmart, it's going to be the same price. So I'm going to just buy them here and just be done. Like paper napkin. I think this ended up being cheaper there. But I find that that grocery store is not one of the cheapest. Love this. I don't know why I didn't get this in gold. But also, at any point, I could spray paint this gold. So this is always full and on my table. Hi, honey. Is everything okay? She's looking at me like, Mom, who are you talking to, girl? The bread on the table. These seasonings my mom asked Mr. to send at the post office for her and he just did not, so they're still here. So let's put them in here. Maybe one of the days if I have time, because the problem is I don't have time and I'm always at home with me. So mm. anyways, we have bread. I just bought one because I'm gonna do my regular um Walmart grocery shopping. Later on, I'm gonna change this because it's hot. So I wanna change it into this black little um, house dress. It's not really a house dress, but like I wear it inside. But I bought a pineapple because this morning we were at work having a debate, basically closing out the shift, having a debate and realizing that pineapple has more vitamin C and just a lot of other vitamins than oranges have. So I said, I'm gonna buy it and I'm gonna try it with Mia. I have to Google it first to see when it's good to try with babies. The rest of my fruit shopping, I'm gonna do on Walmart, but I definitely wanted to get that. I have these things that I bought for her to try. She's about to be eight months in a couple of days here. So I have these little, this one is for eight month old. I'm gonna give her one right now and try. I've given her snacks before and she's done well with it. Here honey, you wanna try that? Instantly puts it at her mouth and bites a piece off. What do you think? <laughs> she's definitely going to eat it. She's not a picky eater and she also does not play with food. So I'm going to leave this out. Things that I'm giving her at the moment. I always leave them out, but I wanted to try some new lot of things for her this grocery run. I also got these yogurt melts. These are also for eight months. I'm gonna put one down on her little thing and see how she does with that. But she's really good at like picking things up and putting it in her mouth. Last night I was having some um some Cheerios. Um just plain Cheerios and I put some down for her and she was eating them up. So she she could manage. I got her three more rice cereal because I mix it in with her fruits and everything. And I also got this little um this uh, reminded me of the Cheerios last night. This has choline, which is really good for baby's brain um, development, brain support. I'm now realizing that, so I'm probably always going to repurchase this one. It has antioxidant, vitamin C and E. It has vitamin B12. And uh, yeah, I don't see what age crawling baby. So around eight months too so far she really likes sweet potatoes and she really likes carrots so pretty good so i have three little snacks to like 
basically interchange her with plus the other one that I had. I still have this teether and she doesn't really do well with this at all. Honey, is that the melt? Where's a little melt? Should I eat up the little yogurt melt? Yep, she definitely has it in her mouth and it's already disintegrating. So that's good. So this is where I have her stuff basically. Um, I have some of my stuff too. I, I need to throw this out already. Mommy brought some bush for her, some cool bush. Those are so damn old. All right, so we're gonna put the new rice cereal in there. Oh, I need that. new ones one old one I can put these back up here now I have these in prunes and she doesn't have any issues pooping so I haven't been able to give them to her just yet I'm gonna put you guys up here and so y'all can out here and so y'all can watch me basically just organize the rest of up there because there isn't really anything to really talk through so you guys can just watch So guys, when I was buying, they had like the baby food in the little containers that were like chicken and rice or whatever. But I didn't even bother buying that one because I give her real food. Like when I'm eating, I give her chicken, I give her um mashed potatoes, you know, stuff like that. So I didn't even bother to buy that one. She's not really eating this right now. So I have some, I think, carrots and stuff in here. I'm going to just put this in the side of this little pouch as well. And we're going to take it to the bedroom and try her later again because I don't like force feeding, nor do I like the idea of force feeding. If she's not eating at the moment, it's okay, we'll try again later. And she just ate the puffs and stuff, so it's not like she's not eating at all. She just doesn't want this right now. But also, she's a thumb sucker. The girl will suck her thumb all day long. So we have it in the little pouch. We're gonna just mix that all together. And when I retire to the bedroom, I'm gonna bring with me to one o'clock so we could be out here for a little bit, sit in the living room for a little bit. We'll put these up here. So for the next 30 days, she has more than enough of her little um, pouches and stuff that she can eat. I also give her real fruits because this morning I put a piece of banana into this little Dr. Brown's musher for her. And she really ate it up. She sucked it down to nothing. We're going to sit in the living room and enjoy some time on her little play mat. See what she wants to do. Maybe I'll even do a little ab workout. See you guys later.